Hello and welcome to this tutorial. I'm Peter Sundell and an application engineer at Victor Sweden. This video is about mappings in Prevision. Mappings reference model artifacts from different layers of the EE architecture. For example, you can with mappings reference an ECU in the hardware layer to the installation location in the geometric topology layer. These references can be between any architectural layers and represent a consistent realization of functions, components, connections and more. The implementation of mappings should follow the same top-down approach as the modeling does. If this is done continuously, it guarantees traceability of artifacts across all architectural layers. In Prevision, mappings are artifacts like all other things you create or edit. We store them in a dedicated place of the model view, in the mappings container. Different types of mapping artifacts are used to reference different artifact classes. And to organize this, there are parent objects of many kinds. These can be reorganized in several ways to fit your project. There are several ways to connect artifacts via mappings, and one easy way is to just drag and drop one artifact upon another in the model view. Prevision will create the mapping artifact and place it in the set workspace. Mappings attach to two reference artifacts, and in the properties, there is a source slash target page that are pre filtered to make the selection of what to connect easy. If you prefer, you can also drag and drop the artifact to the mapping to set the reference. Mappings can be seen in many views and opening the dedicated mapping view will display all set mappings for all product lines in the loaded model. The list can grow long by using filters can make navigation easier. In diagrams one cannot see the referenced artifact directly, since they belong to different architecture layers. But you can select to show a box that displays the mapping used for the artifact found within the diagram. Using the context menu or the keyboard shortcut Ctrl plus M, the Select Mappings dialog lets you pick what mappings that should be shown and how it should be displayed within the diagram. The shortcut Ctrl plus Shift plus M is a quick way to show all mappings by immediately displaying a box with all mappings listed. In tables you can create mappings too by drag and drop of artifacts to the right column. The mapping artifacts are created by Prevision and placed in the configured workspace. If you dereference the artifact in the table, the mapping is deleted in the same operation. 